Well, we were talking about too cold to open the parks. How about too cold to spawn? The DNR says the cold weather is having an impact. Officials say the low temperatures have delayed sturgeon spawning season. Fox 11's Beth Jones tells us other species are also behind schedule. It wasn't even the end of March last year when sturgeon had taken over the Wolf River to spawn. But this year, already a few weeks into April, rivers are quiet. Night and day difference. Last year we had fish spawning earlier than we ever have, and this year we're going to have fish spawning later. Not later than we ever have, but later than average. DNR officials say this year's unseasonably cold weather has delayed the spawning season. Typically, the peak is between April 15th and May 1st. But it shouldn't impact the survival of the eggs or anything like that. Uh, the only impact that it would have is that the fish might be a little bit smaller coming into the winter. Into the winter. Northern pike normally are done by this time. DNR fisheries biologist Steve Hogler says the sturgeon aren't the only fish feeling the chill. He says pike and walleye spawning is also about two weeks behind schedule, and the delay could have an impact on size as well. These fish are going to have a much shorter growing season potentially. You never know, we may have a really nice summer and they'll grow really fast, but potentially they may have slow growth this year and be smaller going into the winter. Once the weather warms up, the DNR expects the fish will move in rapidly. And with a promising forecast, they hope that will be sometime next week. Beth Jones, Fox 11 News.